Namaskar students take out your junior maths book for chapter number 3 that is large numbers part 2 we will start with the number between <coughs> here you can see everywhere two numbers are given okay the first one is here 9999 So we will have to find out the next number. So we add one with it, and we get the after number. So if we add one with nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine, the number comes as ten thousand. That is the largest number of five digit. Sorry, smallest number of five digit. It is the largest number of four digit. And next number is here. Yeah, it is ten thousand, and the next number is ten thousand. One. <clears throat> Now the second one is twenty-five thousand. We have to write the next number. That is the after number. The same way we add one with the number and get the after number. So twenty-five thousand plus one. It becomes twenty-five thousand one. <clears throat> and twenty after number twenty-five thousand and two. It is given. Now we will go to third one. <clears throat> It is ninety-nine thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. So what will be the after number of it? We have to do <coughs> addition. What addition? One. So we have to add one with ninety-nine thousand nine hundred and ninety-nine. So what what number do we get? We get <coughs> one lakh. That is the smallest number of Six digit, and after one lakh, the next number is one lakh one. It is already written over there. <clears throat> Now we will go continue the pattern. Here you have to see how the numbers are written. <clears throat> Accordingly, you have to write the next numbers. <clears throat> Here it is three thousand five hundred. It is three thousand five hundred and fifty. It is three thousand six hundred. Okay, so thousands plus it is. It remains the same. Three thousand, three thousand, three thousand. Now five hundred to five hundred fifty. It is increased by fifty. Then five hundred fifty. It is also increased by fifty, and it becomes six hundred. So now we will have to write the next number. Increasing by fifty, so three thousand six hundred. Then thousand place remains same. It becomes three thousand six hundred and fifty. <coughs> Now the next number again, <coughs> it will be increased by fifty. So thousands place will be the same. Six hundred fifty will become seven hundred. Now you see the next pattern. Seven thousand nine hundred, seven thousand seven hundred, seven thousand five hundred. Then how you have to write the next two numbers? Here you see the numbers are in are decreasing by two hundred. Nine hundred becomes seven hundred when it is increased by two hundred, and seven hundred also becomes five hundred when it is increased by yeah, decreased by two hundred. So <coughs> all the numbers. Are decreasing by two hundred. So if here also you see the thousands place remains same. Hundred place is decreased by two hundred. So if five hundred is decreased by two hundred, then it becomes three hundred. So thousands place remains same. And five hundred, if it is decreased by two hundred, it becomes three hundred. Now again, the thousands place will remain the same, and three hundred it is decreased by one hundred, two hundred. Then it becomes one hundred. So seven thousand one hundred. So here you see all the numbers are decreased by two hundreds, and here all the numbers are increased by fifty. <coughs> Now we will go to place one. Here you see. Numbers are written. Two numbers are written. <clears throat> First one is forty-six thousand three hundred ninety-two. Place values 
are written above the number. <coughs> you will have to write the place value here. First one it is given as 3. Place value of 3 is 100. So you have to write 300. Next comes 6. Place value of 6 is 1000. So we have to write 6000. Now place value it is 9. Place value of 9 is 10. So we have to write 90. Now comes 4. Place value of 4 is 10,000. So 4, 10,000 means 40,000. Now last one is 2. Place value of 2 is 1. That means it will remain 2. Next number. Here. Lab. 10,000, 1,000, 100, tens and ones. <coughs> 1 lakh 35,642. Place value of 5,000. So we have to write 5,000. Next comes 2. Place value of 2 is ones. So it will be 2. <coughs> Next one is 6. Place value of 6 is 100. So, we will write 600. Then, place value of 1. That is lakh. So, we will have to write 1 lakh. Now, the last digit is 3. Place value of 3 is 10,000. 3, 10,000 means 13,000. Oh, one more number is there, that is 4. 4 is in 10th place, so it will become 40. <coughs> now you see ascending order. I told you before, ascending order means to arrange the number from smaller to bigger order. And here, the number with lesser digits will come first. So, you can see 4 digits, 2600. Then again, 321, sorry, 32,766, 759, 40, for, uh, for, for lakh 83,620, and it is 81. So, 81 is the smallest because it is having only two digits. So, it will come first. And after you write, you just put a tick mark. Then, two digits. You see, is that three digits? Yes. 759. It will come second. After 3, there is 4 digits. 2600. So it will come next. 2600. Then 5 digits. 32766. So we will write this one. Now 32766. And the last number, that is the biggest number. 4 lakh 83,000. 4 lakh 83,620. Now we will go for descending order. That is the opposite of ascending order. Here we have to write the biggest number first. And among this number, which one is the biggest number? 683. 4 lakh 52,650. 5,432, 99, and 72,643. So among this number, this is the biggest. So it will come first. 4 lakh 52,650. Then you see, you check the other numbers. Now the number with 5 digits, it will come next. What is that? 72,000, 72,643. Next, number with 4 digits. That is 5,432. 5,432. Okay. Then, rest 2 numbers. 683 and 99. Between these 2 numbers, 683 is bigger, it will come first 
and then last is 99 that is from biggest to smallest order today up to this much students the sums that you have to do in junior maths book is given and also in the maths class work copy but before you do these sums you see the whole process properly then you will go for the sums now shivai students